Okay, so we have an elephant walking on a barrel. <laughs> the barrel has a velocity to the left, and I call that the velocity of the center of mass relative to the ground. And we're trying to figure out the velocity that the elephant must walk at with respect to the top of the barrel. So that's our unknown. <laughs> Now, the velocity of the top of the barrel relative to the ground is equal to twice the velocity of the center of mass of the barrel relative to the ground. We want the velocity of the elephant relative to the ground to be equal to the velocity of the barrel's center of mass relative to the ground. That's so that the elephant keeps up with the barrel and doesn't fall off the barrel. <laughs> We use the Galilean transformation to relate the velocity of the elephant relative to the ground to the velocity of the elephant relative to the top of the barrel to the top of the barrel relative to the ground. relative to the ground minus twice the velocity of the barrel center of mass relative to the ground, which becomes then negative the velocity of the barrel center of mass relative to the ground. So in other words, the elephant has to walk backwards with respect to the top at a speed that's equal to the barrel's center of mass relative to the ground. 